glow from Kingston. I had this like whole vision to like vlog the scenic route and stuff, but I'm not gonna lie. It was a little car sick party in our car. So, you know, we're starting the vlog off in our hotel in Kingston. I'm so excited. We're gonna film like a ultimate fall getaway vlog and we're really excited. Kingston is a super special spot for us. It's actually where Matt and I took our first road trip when we started dating like three years ago and it's just like a full circle moment we're also working with days in canada again which is so exciting because we worked with them on our one year anniversary when we went to lindsay and peterborough ontario so i want to say a huge thank you to days in canada for having us and sponsoring this video i am so excited we're here saturday through monday and we have so many fun fall and like spooky season activities planned it's going to be so much fun you guys don't know there's days in canada locations literally from coast to coast across canada which makes it the perfect hotel for you to stay at for your fall road trip or whatever you are planning to do super comfy and clean rooms free wi-fi helpful staff really easy to check in free breakfast and free parking at select locations and we've stayed at days in canada hotels before and we've enjoyed every experience that we've had and we're super excited to be here in kingston for the weekend to take you guys along on like the ultimate spooky season fall little getaway if you guys do want to book a trip with days in canada you can head to their website www.daysin.ca you can also call their toll-free number which i'll put on the screen it's 1-800 days in or you can walk into any days in canada location and get like the best rate at the front desk but that is not all you guys i'm actually also partnering with neo financial in this video which is so fun for me because you guys know like my two favorite things in the world are personal finance and travel and when i get to combine the two it's even more exciting i already know how much i love neo financial i talk about them all the time they're the cashback credit card that i use and days in canada and neo have partnered you guys use the link in my description to sign up for neo card you'll actually get 50 dollars towards your next stay all the other neo partner locations i actually have a list on my phone of all the places we're going to go to in kingston that have cash back like that's how i plan trips i check the neo app and i see the cash back spots we can go and i'm like yeah we're going there so want to say a huge thank you to days in canada for having us and also neo financial and yeah it's gonna be such a fun little weekend i'm really excited we checked in about an hour ago we went and picked up a few little groceries to have and now we're getting ready to head to the kingston penitentiary which we've both never been to but we're huge into like spooky stuff and like crime and all that stuff so i think it's gonna be super fun and then tonight we're actually having dinner with thomas who you guys know is my manager um he's driving in from toronto and we're having dinner which is gonna be so much fun we finally get to meet after a year and a half of him being my manager and being with shifted digital so i'm really excited for that and then tomorrow we have like a whole fall day we're gonna go to the farmer's market walk around princess street hit up some local coffee shops and also probably do some spooky season stuff like a pumpkin patch or pumpkin inferno i'm really excited so yeah we're gonna get ready to head out i'll either bring you on my phone or my camera i'm not sure but let's go to the pen all right we're walking up i've never been so close to a prison before <laughs> obviously yeah it's really big we just got back from our little afternoon so we did the kingston penitentiary tour which was so much fun i highly recommend especially if you're into like history and true crime um they have an extended one and we kind of wish we did that but maybe next time we're here we'll do that one and then we drove down king street we drove down king street along the water until we got to princess street which is like their main street of like shopping and stores and stuff but 
it's also a saturday at like four so a lot of stuff wasn't open anymore which is why we're gonna go back tomorrow but we just walked around and looked in some shops like you guys saw we got a snack we got a bagel and some bubble tea and we just got back to our hotel and we're gonna go out for dinner tonight like i said with thomas we're going to aqua terra which that'll be super nice and then tomorrow we have a jam-packed day of activities i just booked a trolley tour as well so tomorrow we're gonna do the farmer's market we're probably gonna walk around princess street again try some coffees out go through some stores and then we have a trolley tour in the evening and then pumpkin inferno at fort henry and we did pumpkin inferno last year at upper canada village and it was fun so i'm really excited to do that i feel like travel vlogs are like a decent mix of like just b-roll and then me updating you guys i hope you guys like that but I okay guys we're getting ready for dinner matt where's your outfit from marshall's marshall's marks marks oh yeah you got that when we did our little brand thing mm -hmm. and my dress is from old navy it's like a little midi dress i call this my funeral dress because the only time i've ever worn it was to a funeral <laughs> but it's cute it's like a nice length i think it gets good for dinner and then i'm gonna pair it with my trench coat wait look how badass i look like this ready guys okay never mind i thought i looked cuter than i do i think but anyways we're heading out for dinner road it is 10 30 it's saturday morning we sunday. it's sunday yeah. it's sunday morning it's sunday morning and you know it's a very windy day out here i feel like it wouldn't be a carter matt travel vlog if we didn't find a winners and home sense and home depot to go to so we grabbed coffee this morning at balzac's which i really like balzac's and i was like i didn't know there was one in kings i thought they were just in toronto and um we checked out the Kingston Farmer's Market. We got a little pretzel. It was really windy though, so I haven't really vlogged at all today yet, but we're gonna head to like the more suburban part of Kingston and go to Winners, Home Sense, all that stuff. I got this, I don't know what they called it. I'll put the name of it on the screen. It's really good. It's like pumpkin puree, but with maple syrup. She said it was their fall drink and it's really yummy. And yeah, dinner was so yummy last night and it was so nice to finally get to see Thomas win with the flow today a little bit. We have our ghost trolley tour tonight and then pumpkin inferno later. But in terms of the afternoon, we don't have too much going on. And yeah, we both got our lattes. I have, I have to say, I love their cups. They're so funky. That coffee shop is funky. It's a great coffee like, shop. Like it's great. Great coffee shop. 10 on 10. What was your latte? What would you give it? Um. I'm not a, a latte connoisseur, no. but it, it, it was really good. The espresso was good? I will use it as my base <laughs> now. I have more lattes. <laughs> oh my god. Look at this candle. It's called Ghost Stories. That is really cute. It's like a little haunted house. Yeah. This little... He's so cute. I this one. These are interesting. It, it's so pretty though. What does it say? Ghostly spirit? Yeah. Oh, it's kind of cool, that book. Gosh. You can on top. Welcome. Foolish mortals. Okay, a lot of you guys that live in Kingston told us to come here for books, so we're here.
got sidetracked at the mall because we went in for booster juice and Matt got a new phone and we switched phone <laughs> providers. <laughs> we went to the mall, like I said, and we went up to the Virgin people and we're like, do you guys have any good deals going on? Because at Costco, they, were, they had good deals. She was like, no. So we're like, okay, we kept walking. Then we went to Telus. Was it, is our new phone provider Telus? Yeah. Yep. And Matt was like, what kind of deals do you have for bringing your own phone? And the guy told us, and like, okay, we were like, it's a good deal. And then we were like, what kind of, do you guys have any phone plans for like Canada, US? And he was like, yeah, for, I don't how much am I paying? 60, 70 dollars? Uh, yeah, like 65. I'm paying like $65 a month for 45 gigs of data between Canada and the US. Because before, like not to shame on Virgin, like we enjoyed our time there. But um, I had to pay like $12 a day to use my own data, which is fine. That's what a lot of people do. But because we travel a decent amount to the US, I'm paying like 60 something dollars a month. And I can call too, which was a big thing because I didn't have US calling. And when we called... Disney to like change your reservation, I'd have to pay like $30, $40 in like overages because I was calling the US. So it's really worth it. And then Matt was like, I kind of want a new phone because he's a Google Pixel 3. And Matt got a new phone. Come show me your new phone. Where is it? It's over here. It's over here. So we really are having a banger weekend. I'm really trying to make this vlog so cutesy, but like I'm just not a cutesy person. Like no. I'm just like a. I got I how it is. the S22. <laughs> It's so nice. In black. Oh, I have to. Yeah, you have to start that so. In black. Look at that camera. It's gonna be yeah. a better camera than Carter's camera. It really <laughs> is. You're gonna be taking the best Instagram boyfriend pictures ever. We did some shopping, and a lot of the local stores weren't open, or they were only open weird hours. So we're definitely gonna go back tomorrow and try and buy some more local things because you guys know we like to support local. But we'll give you a haul of what we bought. So we went to Marshalls. This is actually from the road trip here. We got sell this dog toy. It's a Mickey Mouse. Very cute. Mac got these pants for work. Harry Ellis. That is the brand. Mm -hmm. These nice blue pants. Um, I'm just don't mind me. I'm just walking back and forth. We stopped at a thrift store and picked up some books. Mac got this book. He's a former flight director at NASA. Little bookie book. And then this one I'm so excited to read. Did you just fart? No, it's the couch. Oh. Hey, babe. What? I'm just transferring my phone right now. Oh, that's so cool. Mm -hmm. Matt found this book for me at the thrift store. It's called Be Our Guest, Perfecting the Art of Customer Service at Disney. Amazing. I'm really excited about that. And then we went to Old Navy. And Matt got some work pants. They were on clearance, you guys, for like $18. So Matt got two pairs of work pants. And I did not need these, but... <laughs> I bought these spooky season PJ pants. I thought it like fit the vibe and it's so funny because I just like had all these aspirations for this video to be like so like leaves and pumpkins, but that's just not who we are. You know, we're, we're chaotic and we buy new phones on weekend trips and I promise there's like fun spooky stuff coming tonight. Like we're going to go do the trolley tour. We're going to go have a nice pizza dinner. We're going to pumpkin inferno and then tomorrow I think we're going to stroll around downtown more again and then maybe try and find a pumpkin patch but you know a fall weekend getaway is like what you make of it it doesn't need to always just be pumpkins and all that stuff right it could just be like enjoying the fall weather i tried to convince matt to get matching ones and he doesn't like to wear pj pants so it didn't happen but cute pants but it's currently 2 30 we're gonna like chill here for like an hour and a half and then head out to dinner i'm gonna take a shower but that's our little haul hope you enjoyed hope you're enjoying the vlog so far.
Wait, we just got back. I changed into my spooky season PJs. Aesthetic YouTuber who? Spooky season galley. Matt just got into bed. It is 9.25. Oh my God, we're so old. We're literally so old. He hasn't lived here. I'm literally blocking Matt. Like, <laughs> so we had to get donuts from Coffee Wave. They're like a 24 seven like donut diner situation. And oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, come. Are you gonna eat yours there? Or are you gonna make a mess? I'm gonna eat mine here. Okay. Is that mine? Yeah, or? I got an apple fritter, obviously, because it's all I get anywhere. I got a blueberry fritter. Oh blueberry fritter. <laughs> my god, this thing looks amazing. Mmm. That is amazing. Best five dollars we spent on this trip. Can you oh, believe babe. that? Look at that. Well, it's like filled. Can you believe that when you go to like. Mavericks or Suzy Q with like a single donut is like five dollars. This was like a dollar forty. Yeah, when you get like a, a, like a dozen, it's like forty bucks. And then you go here, and it's fourteen dollars for a dozen of them. I'm and pretty I, sure my tea was more expensive than the donut. And I gotta be controversial here. We all love an unhealthy donut. Let's be honest here. Mm -hmm. You're not eating a donut thinking I'm healthy. You're eating a picture like this. It's delicious. Wow. Wow. Hmm. Okay. Vlogged the trolley tour, the ghost, the ghost mystery trolley tour, ghost of mystery, but they pulled down like plastic over the windows because it's starting to get cold. So there was like a glare when I tried to film. I've also recently become a motion sickness galley. So like I just couldn't even think to vlog on it because I was like on the verge of yakking the whole time. But it was fun. I highly recommend if you guys come to Kingston to do the pen. And then also, the, I think the trolley people said that they're, are you like still in shock of how good it was? That was amazing. The trolley people said they, they don't run year round, but if you come around Halloween, it was really cool. It was really insightful, but we are both like history and like spooky stuff. Yeah. And then Pumpkin Inferno, like I, I would say if you're in Kingston, do it. I don't think we need to like go out of our way to drive again. I mean, let's be honest here. We were done in about 15 yeah, minutes. Yeah, we walked through it in like 15 minutes. But we're also speed walkers. But yeah, we're not like people that like to stop and like look at things and admire them. We can like walk and look at it and then like keep going. I wish they'd bring back Fort Fright. That's, yeah. Kingston, Fort City of Kingston, if you're watching this, bring back Fort Fright. Yeah. But Fort I Southern definitely. Has a lot of sway on the Kingston I do. <laughs> Almost 70,000 sway on the Kingston government. <laughs> but um, the trolley tour was really fun. And this donut is really fun. <laughs> Yo, this donut was worth. Hmm. How? This is a 24 hour like little diner and their donuts are delicious and fresh. Amazing. Like I'm shocked. I thought they'd be like stale or. Yeah, I didn't like, expect like, them to be super fresh. Yeah. Like this is better. Like Tim Hortons ain't mm. got shit on this because mm. Tim, what? Just be honest, half the time you get a donut from Tim Hortons, it's like... Okay, right. Bland. Matt has a lot to say. I do have a lot to say. <laughs> I, I love know. how passionate you are about food. My dad yo, always says that. Yo, food Matt is, is so passionate about food. Food is the most important thing. You're right. Because without food, there'd be no reason to live. <laughs> it was weird. You need to lick your fingers or something, buddy. Yeah. Oh, don't do that. <laughs> but we're going to probably watch a little bit of American Horror Story, and then tomorrow, everyone told me that Well, we went to Crave on our first day to get a bagel, but we're going to go back tomorrow because everyone said their cinnamon rolls are like next level and y'all know how much we love cinnamon rolls. Oh, we're getting coffee. We got a coffee there. Oh, and we got a latte. Mm hmm And a nice, nice, nice cup. Yeah, they had a pumpkin nice cold foam. I think I might get a cold coffee and then we'll probably make our way back. We were looking for a pumpkin patch in the area, but a lot of them are closed on Mondays. So I think we'll head home and we're going to take the 401 home this time. <laughs> It's just be a regular occurrence. <laughs> yeah, this should just be a regular occurrence that I motion sick now. So, um, yeah, but we're gonna get ready for bed. That was the best donut. That was like the highlight of my trip. Well, maybe seeing Thomas, but highlight of my trip. Delicious. Okay, we're gonna go to bed and we'll get some coffee together in the morning. I literally vibe with this outfit so much.